Okay, so Eli, I want to believe you know you're three times stable. Yes? I don't want it. Um, you know you're three times stable, so I want you to start. Three times two, write it in, please. <coughs> Bless you. Okay. Can we write that? Can we write that one properly, please? Okay, let's do that again. So why don't you tell me as you're writing what you're writing? Fifteen. So five times three, you say fifteen. Uh. Okay, that's okay. That looks good. One times three. Um, no. Twenty four. So three times four, you like what is it? Twelve. Okay. Okay, good. Okay, keep going. Tell me, tell me what the numbers are. And then the answer. So you say three times zero. Three. Three times three, nine. Okay. Six times three, eighteen. Okay. Three times three. Three times eight. Uh, twenty-four. Okay. Mm. That's fine. That's okay. Seven times three, twenty-one. Okay. That's twelve. Tell me. Tell me. That's okay. Mm. That's okay. Start, start from here so that you have room. 21. Is that what you said? Okay. 10 times 3. So I want you to say the numbers as 10 you 10 times 3, 30. Okay. 10 times 3, 27. Okay. 5 times 3, 15. Sure. It's a pen. Oh, yeah. It's okay. It's a bit sensitive. It's always squiggly. What happened? Okay. Now you want to change it to red? Yeah. <laughs> that is my destiny. No, there's nothing. There's no such thing. Five times three, fifteen. Eight times three. Six. Mm -hmm. 18. Sure, yes. Why are you asking me? Mm. Mm. Okay. Mm. Okay. All right. So this one is a bit tiny, but you can do it. You can fit it in. So all the one you need to do here is say three times one. Then you the one you need to put the answer in the box. Three times two. Are you listening? Three times one, they want you to put the answer in this box. Three times two, you put the answer in this box. Three times one mm -hmm. is three. Sure. Okay. Why are you changing pens? Because this one's very tiny. Okay. Three times two, let's go. Three times two, mm -hmm. six. Mm -hmm. Now... Keep going. Three times three. Let's go. Three, let's go. three and nine. Mm -hmm. okay. How are you going to say these numbers when you have cookie in your mouth? Hmm? Finish your cookie real quick. Three times four. Let's go. Twelve. Four and five? You're asking me or you see it? Three times five is twenty. No. <laughs> Three and five is ten. Okay. That's okay. Actually we can fix that. Just make sure it doesn't um Okay, write that five properly. So it's almost like one. Good. That's a good one. Okay. Freedom 6, 18. Sure. Freedom 7, 21. Sure. Mm -hmm. 3 times 8, 24. Mm -hmm. 3 times 9, 27. Sure. 3 times 10, 30. 
Okay, how about we... What happened? It doesn't let me write on the side? Wait, wait, hold on. This is interesting. Okay, three times um, 11 is what? <sighs> three times 11. 33. We'll fix that. Okay. How about three times twelve? Yeah. Quick. Again. Don't. No, no. It's, it's, it's the angle that you're holding the pen. That's why it's not working. One more time. Okay. Um. Now, can you tell me which ones here? Uh. Uh. Tell us about um, uh, the same as the um, uh, examples of commutative law. Which ones here are examples of commutative law? You have to say the name. Which one? Ten times three. No, no, no. But there is no other ten times three or three times ten here. Do you know what I mean? What do I mean by commutative law? Uh, six times three. Or oh, this one. Three times two and which one? Very good. Yes, you're right. That and that, right? So three times two or two times the same thing. Yes. Okay. Give me another one. Mm -hmm. Which one? Five times three and five times three. That's exactly the same thing. It's not. It hasn't been switched. Okay. So this can be because this is free time. Yeah, that, that was not, it's not a good example. Yeah, so yeah. another one. <sighs> Quickly, you like you oh, don't have all day. This one. Okay. Click on it. And put a this, dot on it. Yeah. This one. Okay. And this one. Exactly, I agree. Three times eight or eight times three is the same thing, right? Commutative law. Yes. We have that in addition, and we have that in multiplication. Okay. And, and did you notice something about? And, mm -hmm. and in the fraction, no commutative for, and division, There's no commutative, no commutative for. That's right. There's okay. Two. Yeah. Let me show you something real quick. Eleven. Oh, actually, I'll give you. Um, twelve times three. So I know that you know that is thirty-six. I know that. But just in case you forget someday, right? Just in case. This is how we do it in multiplication. All you have to do is say three times two is what? Six. Right? Always start with the units, right? Just the way we do it in addition, right? But we're multiplying now. And then you go, three times one is what? Three. Three. See, that's how we have it. So here, come, come, come. So what if I tell you 13 times three? Mm. You do it. Mm. Yeah. Start with the units first. <laughs> Three times three is six. Three times three no. is a multiplication. Mm. Oh, okay. Yeah, do it at an angle. Angle. I think something. I think it wants you to go straight like this. That's why the pen. Okay, sure. And then you go. Three and one. Good. What is that? Three. Three. Thirty-nine. Thirty-nine. Thirteen times three is thirty-nine. Right. So. It's not like there's so much, so many multiplications in this world. It's impossible to remember them all, right? Just to remember them in a flash, right? In your mind, you can really just put the picture of the numbers in your mind, and then you might be able to calculate it, right? So we can go on and say 14 times 3, right? Yes? That is... You're going to have regrouping. That is 121. 14 times 3. Oh, 112. <laughs> No, my dear. 14 times 3 is just the next one, right? 14 times 3 is just adding 3, right? Because what are we doing here? When we say times 3, what does that mean? Times 3? Mm -hmm. When we say times 3, and we're just... That, you skip 3. You, you just skip 3. So if I say 14 times 3, I'm just going to add 3. What if I just add 3 here, Eli? Right? Can you add this for me? This is a plus. It's not a multiplication. It's a plus. I want to say 39. 93. Yes. Is mm -hmm. 
12. What do I write down? 2. 2? Okay, what do I do next? And 3 plus nothing. Mm -mm. I wrote 2. Okay, I wrote 3 two. plus you 2. Cannot... No, right. 9 plus 3, you said it's 12. So I wrote down 2, but what's next? I can't just write down 2. There's something else. Right? Because you said 9 plus 3 is 12. 9 plus 3 is 12. So what do I do after I write 2 down? Because it's 12, it's right? For, it's Nine. 42. It's 42. But <laughs> how did you get 42, Eli? You have to carry that one. You can't miss that step. You can never miss that step. Always show it. I know that you, you know, try to remember it. Show it? Show it on paper. So we write down this two. This one we have to carry. If you don't, if you don't get used to carrying, you're going to miss a lot of numbers because of that. And then you see, so we carry that one here. And one plus three is one. Four. So that's, so this here is the same thing as 14 times three. Right? And I can show you why. Let me show you over here. Look, 14. Take a look. 14 times three. I'm going to, I'm going to show you that we're going to get the same answer as 42. Always. What's four times three? Two. Two. What do I write down? Two. Two. And I'm going to carry one. Yes? Yes? Yeah. And then what's three times one? Three times one is... Three times one is three. Three. And then plus this one. What is that? It's four. Four. Do you see we get the same number? Yeah. Either we do it in multiplication way, or we do it in addition way. It's still the same. You will, you will get the same. Okay, nice work, buddy.